What is up fellow adventurers, Paysetter Ben here bringing you guys a brand new video and today I have a very, very awesome announcement on how you can win free stuff from Frog God Games. Frog God is running a competition for all of its fans and community to compete in. Now I'm just gonna jump straight into it and get into uh, some of the guidelines of this contest. So first, let me start with the thing that everyone is wondering, what is the free stuff? Well, there are two prizes in this competition. First place, you are going to win 400 frog bucks. Now, this is uh, store credit for the website for Frog God Games. Second place is 100 frog bucks. Again, uh, spendable on the Frog God Games website. When does it start? Well, while you're watching this video right now, it's live. When is it gonna end? May 31st. And what do we have to do? Well, that's why I'm here to help you guys today on how to win this contest. Now, what you have to do to compete in this contest is make a video, blog, or podcast explaining your favorite Frog God Games product and why you love it so much. Now, the best part about this contest is you can enter as many times as you want. So uh, about your favorite product, say you pick Rap and Ethic, you can make a video, a podcast, and a blog about it. That gives you more chances to win. Once you have created this post, uh, you're going to want to comment it on the Facebook link uh, that's in the description down below. It's going to be the second link in the description. There you just make it as a comment if you've made a video, uh, a podcast, or a blog. And I say second link because the number one link at the very top of the description today is going to be the contest policy. Now if I went over every single point, this video would drag on and you guys really wouldn't get as much out of it. So I'm just going to hit the main key points of the contest policy. And a quick disclaimer, you also have to be liking our Facebook page. So when you go to comment your submission, make sure you like the page because that's very important. Uh, you're not going to be eligible to win unless you're liking the page. But I'm sure most of you already fit that bill anyway. And like I said, this contest ends on May 31st, 11 p.m. Pacific time. Pacific time, 11 p.m. Please remember that. <laughs> I'm on Eastern time. I know the Pacific time messes me up a lot, uh, especially because a lot of people I work with are on the West Coast. Uh, just please remember that that is when the submission date ends. If you submit past then, unfortunately, we will be not be able to honor your submission uh, is in the running. And like I said, the 400 frog bucks you would win if you get first place and the 100 if you get second place, that is in store credit to the Frog God Games website. There is no kind of substitution, but do not worry because there's plenty of awesome stuff you can get with that prize money. You can pick this book. I personally recommend adding in the Tome of Horrors. The Blight as well is a classic. Look how enormous this, I think I've said this in one other video, but like this would be a weapon in D&D. &D. Like you could hurl that and do like a D6 damage at least, but you know. We, we don't recommend doing that. Play, play the content instead, it's more important. <laughs> and personally, these two are some of my favorite among all the Frog God products. The Tome of Adventure design, I've talked about that a little bit in, a, in another video. And then Bard's Gate, uh, personally, very big fan. Uh, I played a, uh, a campaign with uh, Frog God um, playing through Bard's Gate. It was super fun, fifth edition. It was just a good time. You should check out that book for sure. Another uh, important point here is once the winner is decided, we will announce it on Facebook. And then from there you have seven days to reply to us. Like I said, the rest of it is extremely intuitive. You can see all of that in the top link of the description. Now that all the boring stuff is out of the way, I'm gonna give you some tips to how to win this contest. Now these aren't like trade secrets or bribes. Although a college student working for Disney could use a little bit of a bribe. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm, I'm, <clears throat> I'm joking. But in all seriousness, I have a lot of video uh, experience. I was a live streamer on twitch.tv for about two years, as well as uh, I was able to stumble my way into running this YouTube channel. <laughs> I run my own YouTube channel as well as recently, and quite possibly I could be a performer for Disney World. But more on that later when I get more news about that. So a little tip from your video, personally from me, and uh, don't take any of these tips too to heart, just kind of use them as guidelines for making your video, podcast, or vlog. If you are making a video, I would recommend keeping it within three to five minutes uh, of runtime. Really portray what you want to portray about your favorite product, like for example, if you're running, uh, if you pick Rap and Ethic as your favorite product, uh, explain why you love it, maybe the deadliness of it, uh, maybe you like Mega Dungeons, maybe you like how Frog God has uh, successfully uh, worked Mega Dungeons into this big, uh, not only just monster hotel, but a living ecosystem and story behind it. But whatever you do, I would recommend keeping the video between three and five minutes. That way you just catch the attention, keep it the whole time, and then, you know, wrap it up in a, in a quick but uh, convincing manner. If you're making a podcast, I would say make it like a quick podcast, like 15 minutes uh, roughly, somewhere around there. Um, because if you run on for too long, you know, you lose the entrance, the entrance, <laughs> you lose the interest of your audience. And lastly, if you're making a blog, I would recommend about a thousand words. I think that would be, uh, the sweet spot for a competition like this. Now, if you're making a video or a podcast, sound enthusiastic, really, really show us that you love this product and this company. 
If you're making a video, have a smile on your face and make eye contact with the camera as if you are making eye contact with your audience. If you're making a podcast and a blog, I highly recommend having sort of like a uh, beginning, middle, and an end. That way you don't just kind of run on for 15 minutes. I know I've been uh, kind of subject to that failure before um, in my past of making podcasts and that kind of stuff, but you know, make sure you start it off with why, explain the why, you know, however many points you have on why you love it, and then wrap it up, you know, give an overall overview of, of what you just talked about. Now I talked to Frog, John, or Pex, uh, as many of you know him on the Discord server. He's sort of the head honcho in uh, this competition. And I kind of asked him for tips on what he thinks would help you guys win. I'm gonna go ahead and quote him directly <laughs> so I don't misquote him. We need to be able to embrace their excitement regardless of format. Bleed the passion over the interwebs so we can relate those feelings they are trying to express. Exactly. We really want to sense your passion in this video, podcast, or blog. That, my friends, will get you on the fast track to winning. Other than that, make it interesting. Uh, you know, get your friends in on it and then split the prize fund. Um, if you do win and you're a player, maybe go ahead and treat your dungeon master. We'd be very much appreciative of that. <laughs> and if you are a dungeon master and you win, treat yourself. Buy yourself the Tome of Adventure design. Step up your game. A video that I have made uh, in the past for Frog God Game is how Frog God Games merges the old and the new school. And in this, I relate it to the Tome of Adventure design. Click the card above for some examples on how I kind of uh, worked all those working pieces together to make an overall view of that product. But other than that, just have fun with it, guys. This is, of course, a competition, so you want to bring on your A game, but have fun with it. We really want to see why you all love the Frog God Game product so much. <laughs> and don't worry. Raga Games employees are not allowed to enter, so you won't have to go through this guy. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know your ideas in the comment section down below of what you are going to do to win this competition. And like I said, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. Subscribe to the channel. There is much more uh, Frog God Games and D&D content coming soon. Go ahead and give a like to this video if you liked it at any point. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Keep those rolls and spirits high. We'll see you next time.